Hello everyone, my name is Quad and welcome to the Systems of Warframe, a series in which we take a look at those systems that aren't explained very well. This is a multi-part series in which we take a look at different Tenno schools of Zenuric, Naraman, Madurai, Unairu and Vazarin. Today we will look at the school of Vazarin, which focuses on health regeneration, resilience, affinity farming and reviving. We will start in the middle and go through all the abilities maxed in order. To max the school you need a total of 10,500,000 focus and 2 brilliant Eidolon shards. Let's start with the vase now, first in the middle. Mending Unity increases the affinity gathering range for both Warframes and Operators. The range is increased by 25 meters which means the affinity farming with this way is far easier in the larger rooms. I do suggest you look at the video that is all about affinity sharing I have made on this channel, it should be in the upper right corner. Mending Soul is the next way which might be extremely useful in harder missions when there is hardly any time to revive your Warframes. What this way does is quite straightforward, the first 4 revives you commit to are instantaneous. Your Warframe has 4 charges and your Operator also has 4 charges, so altogether you have 8 charges, quite nice. Guardian Shell is the first ability you can use with the Operator and affects all Operators and Warframes in your affinity range. It costs 50 energy to cast and what it does is a bit harder to explain. Upon casting the ability you will get a shield that always faces the way you look. The shield will be invulnerable, do all damage for 4 seconds and after that you will get a Void Shell of 500 hit points, which acts as an additional non-replenishable health. The durability of the Void Shell is increased with any incoming damage while the invulnerable state is active. The ability is quite good if you ask me, you just need to watch your back. Also I can't say invulnerable, Jesus. Guardian Break is in addition to the Guardian Shell ability that activates each time the Void Shell is broken. What it does is extremely powerful but it sadly only works for Warframes. All Warframes in the Affinity range will get a 150% boost to Shield Regeneration and 90% boost to Shield Regeneration Delay for 8 seconds. This is great for players that love to play Hildren for example. Energy forever. Void Snare is the second ability you get in the Vazarin Focus School tree. What it does is extremely useful for crowd control. It launches a ball that upon impact, or by pressing the ability button again, creates a vortex that pulls the enemies in. The range of the ability is about 8 meters and it lasts for 8 seconds. The cost of casting the ability is 25 energy. This is not everything though. Each time you Void Sling through the enemies in the vortex, you and your allies within the affinity range will regenerate 100 health. This ability also heals companions, defense objectives and everything else. A very nice ability to have. Protective Sling is a way that makes your allies immune to all damage if you Void Sling through them. The immunity lasts for 5 seconds and they are also healed for 60% at a cost of 10 operator energy every 5 seconds. This works for everything but defense objectives, which will only recover 500 health over 5 seconds. The next way, Void Regen only works on your Operator and it regenerates your health when in the Void mode. It starts with 10 health, then it's increased by 10 to 20 and so on to 50 over 5 seconds and then stays that way until fully healed. Squad Regen is an addition to the Void Regen way, it heals all Operators and Warframes in your affinity range when you reach the maximum of 50 health regen with the Void Regen way. The effect of Void Regen is applied to every Warframe and Operator, but nothing else sadly for 60 seconds. Insanely powerful. The next two ways require a brilliant Eidolon shard each to max out. They are the part of the Waybound abilities, the abilities that are always active, no matter which school you play as. Enduring Tides increases the health and armor of the Operator by 200%, so this way makes your Operator a living tank. Other than that, there is nothing special here, but you have to level it up because this is an amazing way to have. Rejuvenating Tides is a way that is perfect for Operator's health regeneration. Sadly, it does only work on the Operators and not Warframes. While you're in the Operator form, you will regen 6 health per second, and while you're in a Warframe, your Operator will regen 12 health per second. Quite nice for Eidolon hunts, if I may add. 
This is all about the Vazarin Focus School, which way or the ability is your favorite? Mine is definitely Void Snare. I love playing as a Vobon sometimes. Vobon. Vobon. Okay. I'm turning French. Jesus. Yeah, I like playing as a Vobon, Vobon sometimes, so using the Vortex is quite fun, especially with the upgrade and the team health regeneration. It is amazing. But with this, I must thank you for watching. Please like, comment, share, or maybe even subscribe. And please have a very nice day. Bye, guys.